All right, well, I'm definitely having second thoughts on the Georgia thing. The, uh, the deposit was very cheap, so if I end up being out that, well, <laughs> less costly to lose that deposit than, uh, than other costs that could come out of that. Um, and the main reason why I am uh, having second thoughts about it is certainly not about oh uh, a gang culture or something like that i'm like look i i i'm from tacoma i was in tacoma in the 90s tacoma in the 90s was was gang central you know uh tacoma in the 90s is to seattle was to seattle anyway what oakland is to san francisco okay it's it's and so in the 90s, there was, there was someone who was shot uh, dead at the end of our driveway. A gang uh, a member shot someone who had just, uh, another black guy who had just got, gotten accepted into college and had his, had his life ahead of him. It was, it, he was, it was tragic. The way that the police and paramedics handled it wasn't so great. And then I never even heard about them catching the person who did the shooting. Almost as if they didn't care. Well, it's just a gang shooting is kind of the way that it was treated. The girlfriend of the guy who was shot, you know, screaming, can you, can you at least check? It looks like he's breathing. He's dead. And they don't even look over, right? So, yeah. Um, but then I've described some things that I've experienced here, and even just recently, okay? The, uh, there is a gang mentality still left over in this city. And I'm sure that someone like Masabi will come, well, you know, uh, gangsters were from the 40s, and uh, yeah, yeah, just, just go away with that. Just, you know exactly what I'm talking about, so. No, the thing is, the weather. I, and the fact that I'm not going to really have anything to do there. I'm not, there's, there's not going to be anything for me to do there. The parks suck. I'm sorry, the parks suck. You, it, to some people, those might be really beautiful. I'm not into the parks that are that are paved the whole way. And then if I go off off trail at all, if there's anything even remotely like that, I'll have the chiggers to deal with. So, and and nowhere that you go do you have cover from the sun. So all these parks are just this this area where you have all this big open section where you can get baked by the sun. Oh yes, that's that's just what I want to go to when I when I want to go to a park. No, I I want shade. They, they, there's, there's nothing around to offer that. So I don't even have that. The areas that um, you can get a nice look at, at a river, um, they're not parks. They're private property, uh, rich people's houses. Um, and I can travel quite a ways and still not get to the type of park I'd like to see. I mean, I have to travel a long fucking time. Hey, let's travel for two hours just to see a nice park. Yeah, that's all right. Uh, no. I just know that that's 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 horrible right and then there's the weather I was on the porch uh, we have a covered porch here in the backyard and but it's it's hotter under the porch than it is when you're not under the porch so it, it wasn't very well designed whatever and I was thinking about how how hot I was there and what I felt like and knowing that what I felt under there was like you know, to think of that, but with, you know, 90 or more percent uh, humidity, uh, but it's at night. Yeah, I, I started going, you know, wait a minute here. So the only way to get any relief during any of the summer months, the only way to get any relief is to be in an air-conditioned room. There's not anything, there's, there's not enough trees around in ways that you can get the, the good shade. I mean, there are some people's yards that have that, but I mean... <sighs> I, I don't know about that, you know? I, I would end up being more of a hermit than I am here. What is there for me to do? Where, where, where am I supposed to go? You know, I, I just sit in, sit in my little place? Well, yeah, I can make my own decisions in my own little place, but I'm not doing anything. And one of the points in my, my wanting to go somewhere was that I, I would have things to do. So I didn't just sit in my place. You know, I, I've been trying to have a positive attitude about uh, about any of this, and, and I think I was going overboard. I was think I was being silly about that. So, you know, if I can't find somewhere by that time that I'm supposed to be moving that supposed to be moving there, then I will still go there, and then at least I'll be on the east coast. And if I want to, you know, find somewhere else, great. 
But what you're looking at on this screen right now is uh, me answering, uh, mostly anyway, uh, me answering Craigslist ads. I am, uh, I, I now realize, you know, I may not like snow, and I may have to gain the skills to drive in it better, but it, it's, at least I can still go out. And if I'm on in somewhere in, in you know, even around Dunkirk or, or oh, what was the name of that other place? J Jamestown, you know, at least there are things to do. There are places to go. I believe that New York has the anti-smoking thing going on, if I'm not mistaken. You know, so I, I'll have a at least have a nightlife. But I'll definitely have to downgrade some things about my uh, uh, about my lifestyle. I'll have to downgrade a lot of stuff because the rent's going to be, you know, probably about three fifty to four hundred, something like that. So, yeah, I'm I'm going to have to downgrade a lot of things, and it will be difficult for me to to do much traveling because I just won't be able to afford it. But uh, those kinds of minuses are something that I think I can deal with better than the minuses in Georgia. And I think if I, if I continue on this and contact enough people, then, you know, maybe something will bite and it will be good. I'm also, I, I, a few places, I checked a few places in North Carolina, but that's still going to be the hot weather. They're really, really, um, the stuff where I just, it's so hot that I won't be outside at all. Be like trying to be in a humid version of Las Vegas, you know? But I, I'm checking into like Pennsylvania and, uh, and Rhode Island and, uh, a little bit of an Ohio and uh, just, just some of the, the states that are just right around that region. But I'm hoping I can find somewhere that's close to Dunkirk because I have a friend there who just just to be able to hang out with someone that I know would be nice. You know, and again, I, I could actually have a nightlife. I could have a life. I think learning to drive in the snow is easier than uh, trying to make my body adapt to a temperature index that I I don't really know whether it can handle. Anyway, um, I'm hoping I'm going to find something soon, though. Um, I hope that... I mean, there's more of a chance of me... of my getting a place through Craigslist, where it's based off of individuals more often, um, than when a place is truly, you know, a well-known business where they have to do everything perfectly by the book and fill in the box, and if you don't fit this uh, particular scenario, well, we can't have you as a, as a tenant here, right? So, like, the out-of-state thing and the uh, no official rental history, um, even though I can have proof that I've paid rent, you know? I, I'll have a little bit better chance with that. There's one place that I think it's interesting is it's on it's right on the outskirts of, of a city and you pay for the apartment by doing uh, it's on a horse ranch and there are some duties that you can do and that pays for your apartment and utilities and I'm thinking to myself well if that's if that's a type of work that I can do and it's not very many hours, you know. Um, I could see doing something like that, and it would make me feel more productive. I would be actually working for that apartment. Um, there were some kind of neat things about that for me. Uh, and so I looked into that too. Uh, now, maybe I asked dumb questions or whatever, but, and if they were, and, and they're like, oh, this guy, you know, why would we want him? I mean, I did blatantly say, hey, I don't, I don't have any experience in that field at all, but I'm curious, so. So we'll just see what happens. Um, we'll see what happens.